Hey guys, I'm Alex from TechnoClass.com and today we're deboxinizing the Cherry Mobile T20 Touch. This is a uh, feature phone, a 3.2 inch resistive touch screen with a bunch of 3D interface uh, stuff. 2 megapixel camera, dual SIM, dual standby, 3.5mm uh, headset jack, FM radio, Bluetooth, Java in built-in games, um, and yeah, Bluetooth. Um, and it's a pretty nice looking phone, dual, dual SIM, there's a box. Uh, let's open it up. And swoosh. Alright, here's the phone itself. Let's turn it on and look at the other parts of the box. There we go. Um, so you, nice speaker. Um, so you open the back right here and you have a... 1200 milliamp hour battery and this plastic is shiny to say the least all right let's get get now to the other parts of the box let's move the top here and you get the USB cable which is interesting because um, most smartphones charge on USB but not a lot of uh, feature phones uh, so this phone actually charges on USB. This is a headset. Uh, looks like a one-piece headset with a microphone and a couple of controls on the middle. Yep, button. Anyway, next is a USB charger. Would be interesting to see if um, if you can charge this with any um, USB-based uh, charging devices. Nice, uh, nice chair mobile logo on that one. All right, on the bottom is a manual. Touch user guide, a bunch of information on how to use the phone, I'm sure. Um, no pictures, not color, but probably helps you a lot. All right, let's get to the phone. It's a white phone with a kind of a black bezel around it. Maybe it would be nice if it were silver. <laughs> All right, so um, 3.2 inch resistive screen. So let's uh, check the, uh, the uh, parts here. Um, this is the speaker grill. Not a lot of badges around here. On the front is uh, it's a badge saying touch. And a, I don't know, I guess it's a home button, unlock button, something. Um, all right, that's the front. On top is a power button. And your notch to open the back. On the left, uh, no buttons or ports here, just a shiny strip. On the bottom, uh, 3.5 millimeter headset jack and your micro, micro USB port here. Uh, on this um, corner here, uh, since it is a resistive touch, touch screen, you can pull out this um, telescopic, telescopic stylus for um, better control of your UI elements. All right, on this side, right side, you have a volume rocker and a camera button. But this looks like a single, that doesn't look like a two-stage two camera key, so it's probably a single-stage camera key. All right, we got the top already. At the back, <clears throat> you have a speaker grill and there are two me megapixel camera. The bottom is a nice, tasty, um, Chair Mobile logo there, nice color, and that's about it. Um, nice and shiny. Uh, let's check out the the interface a little bit here. So slide to unlock, slide up to unlock. Nice, uh, nice um, animation there. Not pretty, pretty spiffy. Um, so this looks like the main menu here. So there we go. This is the home screen. I'm 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 hoping you can add like icons on here. This is the wallpaper. And it's an interesting wallpaper. It has a bunch of 3D wallpapers, and this one is the Cherry Mobile Globe wallpaper. And you can actually play with it. You can actually make it like a globe, and then just push it around, move it around, twirl it around. Nice, interesting uh, 3D effect. Uh, looks like a a clock widget. Um, time on top. Messages. The usual um, notifications that you're used to, battery and two SIM uh, icons there. This looks like a shortcut for the settings. Oh no, it's a customization for your 
um, main screen here so that's interesting and this looks like a shortcut bar as well it has shortcuts for your contacts your um, messages calendar calculator and settings um, hitting this button oh, for, wrong uh, missed, missed, or missed button this is the dialer Not, also another interesting 3d effect here as you can see um, this is also another carousel menu which you can scroll around I'm, I'm hoping you can add more icons here or just remove icons so you can pick the stuff you want and it's a nice effect uh, not 3d but it's a nice effect you know, this this here is the main menu and kind of reminds me of the iPhone menu but it has the uh, like a um, tilting tilting effect of the Android um, gallery uh, it's a nice um, nice set of um, applications that seem to be pretty useful like a bunch of alarms a bunch of a cherry zone email flicker um, would like to see how 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 they, we could use them. Uh, this has two SIMs, uh, dual standby, um, but this doesn't have 3G, doesn't have Wi-Fi. So you're going through GPRS on this one if you're going to use um, a bunch of the online apps. Um, I think it has a couple of games and stuff. So pretty interesting phone with a bunch of uh, apps and 3D features. Definitely with the uh, this thing. Um, and if you hit this button here turns into a cube. Menu turns into a cube. Isn't that cool? <laughs> a lot of 3D effects. A lot of 3D effects. Uh, that's interesting. Um, makes for a very um, cool looking interface. Um, not bad. You, you have to, the touch screen you have to push in a little bit because it's a resistive screen but once you get used to it it's not bad. Um, I'm not sure what else kind of features we can check. Um, We'll try and review this phone, maybe give you first impressions and see more, uh, explore more of the phone. Maybe we haven't covered some parts of it because we don't know where it is yet. So that, that's it. This is the uh, this is the uh, Chair Mobile T20 Touch, and it's available for three five nine nine. So that's about three thousand six hundred pesos uh, from Cherry Mobile, and I believe it's. It is available now. So, yep, this is Alex from the Thanks for watching.